everyone and welcome to this very special day. I never thought all those years ago that I'd be standing here after 10 years of struggling to have children. I got my two amazing sons, then the cherry on the cake, my beautiful daughter and my best friend. I'm so proud of the woman she's grown up to be. She has been such a support to me over the last few years in every way. Rachel, thank you for being the most amazing, beautiful, smart, caring <laughs> daughter. Love you to pieces. Ian, welcome to our family. And now that you've taken Rachel from me, I hope you're going to love and cherish her as I do. Because, to quote Liam Neeson, if you don't, <laughs> I will look for you, I will find you, and I will kill you. I'm only joking, I love him really. I know it's not traditional for the bride to make a speech, but for those of you who know me, this will not have come as a surprise. I'm known for having my say, so Ian, congratulations to a lifetime of listening to my opinions. I want to start by thanking you all for being here to celebrate with us. I've always th thought that that sounds really naff and cliche, but each and every one of you are here because you're special to myself and Ian. Thank you to Ian's family, particularly to Alex, the best man, for achieving the impossible and getting Ian here sober and on time today. <laughs> Yeah, ish, ish, that's fine. Um, Stuart and Margaret, I want to thank you for raising Ian to become the man that he is today. Living with Ian, I take my hat off to both of you. As I know, I know that this is no mean feat. I know you'll both be more than happy passing the baton on to me to carry on looking, looking after Ian for the rest of our lives. There'll be a number of toasts in this speech, so make sure your glasses are full and enjoy the moment. I intend to get you also tipsy so you won't remember me playing guitar and singing later on. <laughs> By the way, for those already drunk, nice one. My name's Ian, I'm the groom. This is my lovely bride, now Mrs Mack, an official clan member. So please stand for Mrs Mack. <laughs> Mrs Mack. This place in which we are now met has been duly sanctioned according to law for the celebration of marriages. And you, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, are gathered here to witness the joining in matrimony of Ian James MacDonald and Rachel Elizabeth Newton. They have drawn closer to each other and now wish to affirm publicly their relationship and to offer each other the security that comes from vows sincerely made and faithfully kept. Do you, Ian, take Rachel here present to be your lawful wedding wife? I do. <laughs> take your time. Yes. <laughs> Well, we all like suspense. <laughs> and do you, Rachel, take Ian here 
women here present to be your lawful wedded husband? Mm. <laughs> I do. <laughs> I call upon these persons here present to witness that I, Ian James MacDonald, do take thee, Rachel Elizabeth Newton. To be my lawful wedded wife. To be my lawful wedded wife. Ian, I promise to love you tenderly. To cherish and respect you. To cherish and respect you. To laugh with you. To laugh with you. And cry with you. And cry with you. To comfort you with my gentleness. To comfort you with my gentleness. And support you with my strength. And support you with my strength. I promise to walk with you. I promise to walk with you. In sorrow and joy. In sorrow and joy. Illness and age. <laughs> Illness and age. Facing life together. Facing life together. Right. <laughs> Wherever it it's may not me, take you. us. <laughs> Wherever it may take us. <laughs> and to be loving, faithful and loyal. And to be loving, faithful and loyal. From this day forward. From this day forward. Rachel, I give you this ring. Rachel, I give you this ring. As a symbol of my endless love for you. As a symbol for my endless love for you. Ian, I give you this ring. As a symbol of my endless love for you symbol of my endless love for you. All that I am. All that I am. And all that I have. And all that I have. I bring to you. I bring to you. May this ring. May this ring. Remind us of this moment. Remind us of this moment. And the commitment I have made to you. And the commitment I have made to you. It is therefore my privilege and very great pleasure to say that you are now going to be married. You are husband and wife. Congratulations. You're beautiful. Okay. My name's Ian, I'm the groom. This is my lovely bride, now Mrs. Mac, an official clan member. It all started nearly four years ago on Tinder. I swiped right and we matched. But what did I get myself into? Three weeks of hard graft, countless videos of me singing for a date, then it happened. She wanted to meet me. Boom, I'm in. <laughs> Please stand for Mrs. Mac. <laughs> so I walked in, proud as punch, with a bunch of flowers. I get down on one knee and pop the big question. As I open the box, she sees the ring. I'm thinking to myself, she's not going to say anything. I think she was more in shock that it was a Harry Bow ring <laughs> than me even asking the question. Uh, both me and my brother are both adopted from other families. Uh, we are the luckiest kids going because we did get the best parents ever. Um, both of us are fantastically uh, grateful and lucky to have been chosen um, and I am very proud to call Ian my brother from another mother. Uh, when I was stood up there and I saw I saw his reaction to Rachel turn up the aisle, it was beautiful and um, I can't imagine um, any two people better suited for each other um, and good luck Rach and, <laughs> and honestly Honestly, well done Ian, because I would say batting above your average, but I mean, that doesn't say it, I would say not even in the same game. <laughs> so well done Ian, and congratulations to both of you. I love you both. So thank you darling, and countless hours spent on this day. We've had so many adventures. And today marks the start of a new chapter. You're so special to me. You're my everything and more. I'm proud to call you mine. I love you to the day I die. You're my best friend, wife. You're my Ted. Thank you. <laughs>